guys, so as requested like ages ago, I'm taking a really long time to get to all of these, but this is my take on Amy Ponce from The Impossible Astronaut. I did cosplay her at Lords of Time too, if you were there, and if you also watch my videos, and I'll insert a picture of me cosplaying her here. As well as the original pictures of Karen and stuff, so that you can sort of compare hair and stuff. But for cosplay, I find this very good. This is also really relevant to any other Series 6 cosplay. And yeah, so it's... I don't know how to describe it. It's sort of curly but swooshy because it it curls inwards on this side, but it, like some of them curl outwards on this side. And it's basically just using hair curlers. It does matter, the, like the sort of direction that you're curling hair because it makes it look different. But if you sort of want to know how to make this hair, then keep watching. Okay, so first I've just sort of parted my hair very roughly to the side. It doesn't really matter if it is perfect or not, just roughly off to the side. And next I'm taking my Tresemme heat protectant because you really shouldn't be damaging your hair with your um, straighteners. Next I'm just fluffing it about so that it dries a bit before I start putting heat onto my hair. You probably want to make sure that your hair has no knots whatsoever before you start the curling bit as well. Next I'm parting my hair into two sections and tying up the top bit with a hair scrunchie. Once again, I'm just brushing through my hair very quickly to make sure there are no knots. Then I'm taking my GHD straightening iron and I'm going to be using it for curling. So first of all, I straighten my hair once and on this side I'm going to be curling inwards. So you curl the curl so that it's sort of going um, downwards through the iron if that makes sense. I demonstrate it on this side as well. Then I'm splitting my hair into another section. I actually ended up deciding that I wanted to do three sections because then you get more variety of curls and it makes it more, look more voluminous if you have more layers. Okay, this time I'm doing the same sort of straightening the hair to get it all warm and then I'm curling upwards for this layer so that I get the swooshiness that she sort of has. And then you get the curls going a different direction to the ones that are on the layer underneath. And I continue to do that all around my hair. Yep, and that's what it looks like so far. Next I'm just going to spray it. And now I'm on to my top section. Now I'm going to brush my hair through. I'm also going to backcomb it. This, I'm backcombing the bit that's going to be pinned back to the side. And now I'm going to curl my hair inwards to my face. On the side that I'm demonstrating right now, all of the curls are going to be curled inwards to your face, if that makes any sense. I'm also going to be curling just slightly inwards the top parts of my hair that didn't really get into the curling iron. I'm also ruffling it about so that it doesn't look so straight and like really neat. On the other side, I'm going to be curling my hair in really, really random orders. So some underneath, some outwards, some to the back. Some I'm flipping the hair, like the ends of the hair upwards in my curling iron. If you don't know how to use a curling iron, I didn't really explain it very well in this uh, in this video. You could YouTube how to curl your hair with a, with a 
straightening iron. As I said, I didn't really explain it. Next, I'm just spraying my hair. And now I'm going to pin it to the side with a very small black butterfly clip. You could use a bobby pin, but Amy Pond wears a black butterfly clip. Next, to make it even more fluffy, it's important that you brush it through just very lightly with a... I'm using a paddle brush, but you could use a white tooth comb or even your fingers. As well as brushing it downwards, I'm also fluffing it up, sort of like back combing it, but very, very lightly. So as you can see, it's got a lot more volume than before. It's not super, super neat. The curls just sort of fall not naturally, because you can tell that it's been done with an iron. But yeah. Now I'm just going to go and fix the bits in my big mirror. But once you're happy with it, you could spray it again, but I'm just going to leave mine. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.